To our, st our top story, it's making international headlines. An Oregon mom accused of throwing her son off the Aquina Bay Bridge. Brent Weisberg has the very latest from the coast. Today, there are grief counselors on hand at London McCabe's Elementary School. Police say the six year old boy was murdered when his mother threw him off of one of Oregon's most iconic bridges. It's just a very tragic story. Today, complete strangers like this woman named Ruby came to the Yaquina Bay Bridge to honor a six year old boy who they've never met. We have a possible water rescue getting a report that the caller said he threw his son off the bridge. Within moments of the first 911 call, police and firefighters in Newport scrambled to get as many resources under the Uquina Bay Bridge. Police say 34 year old Jillian Meredith McCabe was standing at the mid span of the bridge. Authorities say McCabe threw her six year old son, London, over the railing and then called 911. The U.S. Coast Guard had a helicopter overhead within minutes. Two boats patrolled the choppy water looking for any signs of London. Six year old boy, his name is London. He's wearing blue jeans, a brown and white striped shirt. The stripes run sideways. Court documents say when the first responding deputy got on the bridge, McCabe was holding her cell phone. She reportedly ended the conversation with dispatchers by saying, quote, There is a police officer here. Detectives tracked down Matthew McCabe, Jillian's husband. Investigators learned that Jillian was the only one supposed to be taking care of London because he was autistic. It just touched my heart when I found out that he was autistic. The boy's body was found about a mile downstream from the bridge. Detectives used a photo sent to them from Jillian's husband to confirm it was in fact London. Detectives have not released a motive in this case, and they are still asking for the public's help. They say if you were on the Uquina Bay Bridge yesterday and you saw anything suspicious, detectives would like to hear from you. We have their phone number on our website at coin.com. Reporting in Newport, I'm Brent Weisberg, Coin 6 News.